Hello Libra, this is Brandy. Don't forget to subscribe. Um, hi. <laughs> uh, this is for August 2021. This is a general reading, okay? You have to apply it to your life, how it goes, as it's general. But love, life, career, they always go hand in hand. Please keep that in mind. So you're bored with a financial situation, with a home situation, with a relationship, you're bored. You're discontent. You feel like you've done everything. Like, is this going to go any further? Am I going to get any more money? Am I going to get a raise? Are they going to ask me to marry them? Where is this going? There's silence. It's kind of weird. Like a dead silence. No more movement right now. That's because you've done everything that you can. I think you got about three more months because I have a seven and a ten. You have three more months for this to fully start to grow into what it needs to be. If it doesn't and they don't give you anything by then, okay. If that's a relationship, you need to go. But it seems like three is a heavy number here when I subtract. Right? <clears throat> um, I think you're looking for a raise, but it's like you're bored of doing the same thing. Maybe you need to switch it up. Um, you're bored in the bedroom, maybe you need to switch it up. I mean, people really lack communication when it comes to relationships or going after what they want. I'm very vocal. People don't take me seriously, but I'm like, hey, you know, maybe we should try some sex or maybe you should give me some more money. See how easy that is? Okay, just saying. But... Offside, different subject. Uh, I do have, like, a lot of things going wrong. One, because you're not supposed to be doing this anymore. Two, very bored, connected to someone else that used to play emotional mind games with you. It's like you've tried to move on, but that gaslighting just got you. It's ever lingering, right? Ever lingering. You may be doing good right now, and that person just flashes back in your mind, so you think it's your soul calling could be could be trying to get you to reach out so they don't have to be the person that you know they should be they want you to reach out <clears throat> so they don't have to do the work oh hey nice of you to call me right mm, whatever my eye thing <laughs> but uh if you feel a lot of intense restriction coming to you at this moment that is because they are trying to get you to emotionally mature and emotionally grow so I do feel like there's a lot of things that are kind of slipping up and tripping you up right now in your life um, because you're bored. They want you to get you out of the rut that you have put yourself in, no matter how that falls in your life. Um, I definitely have someone who thinks they're great, but I also have something about pulling your resources. It's time to pull your resources to get what it is that you're wanting to do and to start setting it in motion and it's going to take a couple tries to get what you're after you're welcome and then you will start to see where maybe you need to fix things in it you know what i mean i have the seven of pentacles the four of cups that was pre-pulled and the ten of pentacles if you wondered where all that came from it's like those little Picture things that the psychologist gives you for us. Even even psychics, right? I can stand next to you and I can tell you stuff about you. But when I have this to focus on, you go on the basic meaning. But then it's like the pictures from the psychologist. You pick up a lot more, if that makes sense. I've lost my phone. <laughs> it's not done on my, it's on my tablet. Okay, we have strength, number 11. The four of cups. I'm a thief. Four of Wands. And the Moon. I was kind of feeling the Moon. <clears throat> uh, yeah, so there's like a lot going on that the Universe, Spirit, all that shit is like <laughs> hiding. It's like changing beneath the surface where it's like that's why you're bored. Because you can't see it in the physical, but it's going on in the spiritual to bring like the abundance to bring what it is that you're after that's why they said pull your resources but it's like you get off track you're focusing on the wrong thing first 
and that's why it takes a couple tries to get what you're after because you have to learn the failure to get to the success i tell people that often this is something you have to do on your own that's why it's pull your resources not everyone else's and that's when it's complete what is in the middle of this oh it's almost like a bearded dragon i've never seen that before it's a bearded dragon. There's a lot of yellow, too. It's almost like, um, you see this, right? It's those fence poles, right? And it's, it's like building all the magic and stuff going into, like, this big energetic ball. I definitely don't know the meaning of a bearded dragon if you see one, like, randomly or have a dream about it, so maybe you can look that up. I also have like a collie over here. There's a ton of yellow in these two cards, like the gold of protection. Right? You all see the gold, the protection, the the spiritual workings going on there. Yeah, it's like you have too many <clears throat> How would I put that? You have too many attachments to how something's supposed to go, and that's why it keeps pushing you back. We're going to take this one. Two of Pentacles. Right, and I'm going to pick the rest up. Mm, goodness, I can't really pause this to, like, collect myself because I'm on the tablet. That's what sucks. I still don't have anything. So, what, where we went to, it was someone's vacation home. Um, old, older people, older people. So you're gonna see shit all around me because I don't have my setup still. Uh, and we have to wait till everything clears before we can start having our normal setup. So it's been a bit here, and internet really sucks. Really sucks. I'm trying the Verizon Wi Fi, but like the data's not regulated. It's. I don't even know. So, anyways. Um, <clears throat> $40 for nothing, pretty much. That being said, sorry, off track. It's kind of like you got off track, track, though, too. So everything I say, do, always has a meaning. Right. Oh, that's upside down. So I have the King of Pentacles. The Six of Wands. The Star. Right? It's like remain optimistic it is but you're too attached to certain outcomes and that outcome's not going to be exactly as you imagined and that's why you're getting off track right what time is it okay. i feel like someone's thinking about having an affair you should probably have some communication before you do that because you may wreck a good thing or someone's having an affair with you it's to separate you okay so we have the sixth house as the major that's what i've been doing as the major placement okay like what's really you know the focus what you need to focus on so the sixth house uh, house is in virgo uh, i was kind of feeling a pisces virgo energy for you libra so could be someone you're messing with or with especially the moon here um so that's uh with six health house i cannot say that because i have a large tongue it's crazy anyways the work the health the duty the area of your life so you are like i said wanting this outcome not paying attention to these things and this is all about organization organization is the key you know step by step things focus on the big picture not the small minute you have to do the small things but over obsessing on the small steps it's like you're you're wanting to jump from point a to z without doing the in between and you you can't do that which is stressing you out causing stress on your relationships whether that's work or home and they're wanting you to heal that because you're you're suppressing all of these emotions or something or the person vice versa and you're not able to fix it i'm gonna read the sixth house out of the 
this for you because I don't know it. I just decided to pull these out and use them. I mean, I know what the sixth house is about, but I want to read what this is from the book. Alright. Okay. <clears throat> this area of your life is the realm of work, duty, and service. It includes health matters to do with wellness and fitness. It concerns how we care for our bodies with regard to regular medical matters, such as routine health appointments. You may have concerns about your health and decide to take up a diet, a supplement, exercise, whatever. It's we worry about overindulgence, <laughs> overindulgence and deny ourselves too much self-gratification. So it's a good time to reduce the calories you consume. This will describe the universal energy that influences these matters now. See? Um, something about your personality or ego is absorbed with this certain matter that you're here about. You know, the titles in me don't really go along sometimes because I get a lot of information. So I like pick the one that stands out most at the end. So keep that in mind. Um, this includes work that must be done. The working environment, fellow workers, the work could be for an income to keep your house in good order included one servant it's about service today but now it's how we serve in this house that we can find pleasure and fulfillment when a task is well done because we feel good we honor our sense and duty of hard work it concerns worry for this worry area of your life you are worried you should know that this is to be expected entirely in keeping with this part of your personality your concerns are simply a part of life that we have to dip into now and again. They keep us on our toes and make sure we pay extra special attention to something that we wouldn't bother with otherwise. So no need to worry too much about your worry. Because I feel like there's a lot that's coming in around you. And that's really to release you from the rut that you put yourself in. So it's like don't fight it. Whether that be with work, person, whatever. It's like you've got to learn a different way around it because the one you've been doing isn't cutting it. They're trying to let you know that. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm going to pull a shadow card because everyone has a shadow side. And I'm going to leave you to it. Addictions, which is overly worrying, overly working, overly whatever. Think about the emotions you're trying to cover up. Which is why I said I think someone was wanting to avoid the relationship or whatever and just jump into an affair. <clears throat> Deal with those emotions. Process, heal, and release them. Because you're stuck on them. It's too attached to the outcome so nothing good's going to come of it because you're not speaking up. You're just wanting to jump from A to Z. It's not going to work out well. Alright! <laughs>